So hey everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Or if you're new here, hello or welcome. I'm Jack, but when I'm in drag, I go by Luna Rose, cause I'm the flower that blooms at night. And as you can read from the title of today's video, we're gonna be doing a Shein haul. So let's get into it, shall we? So I purchased all of these clothes from Shein with my own money, combined with the help of my Patreon family, as well as my OnlyFans family, which I will leave a link to down below. I will also try and link down below all of the outfits and costumes and the works of it all that I try on in today's video. However, Shein does often change up their website and what they sell, so if something is out of stock or no longer available, I will try and find something similar, and let's try it on, shall we? Okay, so the first thing I picked up from Shein is something I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of. And actually the first like few things are all like in the same category since when you buy one thing on Shein, it recommends similar things and I kind of went down a full rabbit hole of buying corsets. But the first one I picked up is this really cute like little leopard animal print corset and Obviously, as you guys know, I am a male, I have a masculine frame, but I like to create a more feminine illusion and have a smaller waist and bigger tits and bigger hips, and corsets are perfect for that. So I kind of went down like a little rabbit hole of picking up a bunch of corsets, and uh, yeah, the first one I picked up is a full-on tacky animal print realness, which, not gonna lie, I absolutely love animal print, like, I love it so much. <laughs> The next corset I picked up from Shein is very much in my stylistic wheelhouse. Since as you guys may or may not know, Halloween is my favorite time of the year. I love anything to do with spooky season, skull and crossbone, anything that lets me live my full on fantasy of being like a fantasy creature of the night. And um, yeah, this corset is a Halloween themed black and white moment. And girl, when I tell you, as soon as I saw this on the website, I was like, add a basket. Literally like didn't even hesitate, didn't even think about it. I was just like, mine, need it. and. She's so cute. And then the next corset I picked up from Shein is just a plain white little steel boned corset. This actually came with like some bunny rabbit ears and the works of it all, but all I saw when I saw this white corset was, hmm, that sounds like a fun craft project. Since obviously as it is a white corset, I can like spray paint this, I can dye this, I can glue fabric on it if I want to incorporate it into a certain look. And I would actually highly recommend like picking up like nude colored corsets or white corsets since they always come in handy with drag. I can always use this for some kind of project in the future. Like even just dyeing it and like attaching chains to it will make it into a full on look and a full on fantasy. And um, yeah, let me know what you think of just a little plain white boobalicious corset. <laughs> Obviously I'm gonna dye the shit out of this and it's never gonna look like this when I wear it. <laughs> <laughs> and then the next thing I picked up from Shein is just like a white little bustier bodysuit moment and I kind of bought it for the same reasons as the corset. Since I figured I could use something like this as like a she transformation since she kind of has a similar like breastplate armour but since it is a white fabric I can literally do anything I want with this. It's so easy to dye white fabric, spray paint it, glue stuff onto it and like embellish it and make it look so different than just the plain white little BCA it is but um yeah, let me know what you think of her. Obviously, in this video, I'll try her on untouched and white, but um, definitely expect me to um, experiment with this piece as well, so I course it, shall we say? <laughs> And then the next thing I picked up from Shein, you'll be happy to know, is not just a little plain white arts and crafts project thing for a future video, but it is a really cute little green co-ord set. Anything that has like this kind of pattern to it, in this tone of green with like buckles or anything interesting harness wise, I just have been gravitating towards so much recently and I absolutely love Shein's little co sets since this is a full transformation in itself, done, dusted, gorgeous, fantastic. And I just love the style and fit of this so much. And um, she's not just a plain white garment that I'm gonna spray paint the shit out of. <laughs> And then the next thing I picked up is in the exact same style as that little white like corset bustier moment, but this one's in like a really pretty like dark blue satin material that honestly just looks so sexy. And I really want to wear something like this with like some black tights and like really corset in my waist, really pad out my hips and give like a full like playboy bunny kind of silhouette with like how this fits. But I thought it could also be really cute if I can try and find a fabric similar to this to attach it to like the waist and do like a full on like train moment with it since this kind of style and fit is just so flattering on literally everyone that I kind of want to embellish it and do extra and make it like draglicious but um the base garment itself super cute girl 
Okay, so this next thing I picked up from Shein, I've had it on my wish list for such a long time. And not gonna lie, I was kind of waiting for it to be like price cut or for some kind of deal to happen on their website. And they finally offered like 25% off if you spend like over 70 quid, which is literally why I bought all these garments. And it is a really cute like little coral reef bathing suit. Generally, I love these kind of bathing suit bodysuits since it hides where I would corset and like where the padding would meet like my belly and everything, but just showcases your legs in their full glory. And bathing suits are always like nice and stretchy and like supportive of like breastplates and everything. And I just thought, this print was honestly so pretty and what I want to do I know it's like a major arts and craft project kind of haul but what I want to do is go in with like matching color like corresponding rhinestones and like rhinestone the ever-living shit out of this and then like make some like resin shells and do like a full-on like coral reef queen like transformation with it since there is just something about this that just screams my name it's so colorful so bold so bright and I actually wanted to be a marine biologist for like the first 10 years of my life so um yeah, I couldn't resist it. Think it's super cute and you may see it in the future like bedazzled, rhinestoned and it's a full on like fantasy. And then the final thing I picked up from Shein, we are going full circle and we're going back to corsets since the last thing I picked up is this really pretty moon and star print corset. Obviously, as I've already said, corsets are one of my favourite things. They are so versatile, they really help you create shape, and this alone could just be a full-on outfit with like a little black panty with sort of a full-on vibe and fantasy. But as you guys know, my name is Luna. I am absolutely obsessed with astrology and stars and the moon and the works of it all. And this one just has the most pretty little iridescent moments of it. And I really want to go in with some like bigger rhinestones and like really embellish this and maybe wear it over the top of like a black dress with a really long train with rhinestones and moons and stars on it. And yeah, again, corsets couldn't help myself I went down the rabbit hole of corsets and this one just has sparkle and reflection and as you guys know I have drag queen magpie syndrome anything that sparkle and reflects I just have to pick it up <laughs> so yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed the Shein haul if you did please give this video a thumbs up comment down below which garment I picked up was your favorite or what I should pick up from their website in the future and don't forget to subscribe to the girl next door with something more there should be new videos every single Monday Wednesday and Friday all at 8 p.m Greenwich Mean Time and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks so much for watching bye Ooh, good tongue pop outro <laughs>